Today was a maximum effort bench press. Started off with incline presses with three sets of chains on the bar. So it basically makes the weight 120 pounds at the top and then the chains deload. So I started out with the bar 45, then went to 95, and then I'm at 135, and then 225, and then I'm gonna finish it up with uh, 280 plus the chains. What this movement does is it works on the upper part of the chest and since I'm adding chains to it, it also works on the lockout of the bench press. If you got chains, you got an incline bench, give it a try. I think you'll like it. The reps I'm aiming for is sets of three. When I do inclines, I like to do anywhere from three to six reps. pressing it out and as far as the angle of the bench I like to use 35 or 45 just depending on how I feel if I want to hit the shoulders a little bit more I'll crank it up to 55 degrees when I first started lifting incidentally 45 degrees was the normal but before I started I heard that 65 was the normal so it's changed throughout time I then moved on to dumbbell bench presses just cranking out sets of 10 the reason I selected this exercise is because yes I want to work the middle part of the chest but also what I want to do is I want some um, work where I can single arm work and uh, dumbbell bench presses fit that if I had a machine I would use that Here I'm cranking out the reps Then moved on to dumbbell flies. For me, dumbbell flies are critical in my bench press. I discovered when I don't do them, my bench press actually goes down, particularly on the bottom portion of it. So this strengthens the pecs at the bottom. And then moved on to band side laterals. I had to get the bands right. These are definitely my favorite form of side laterals. I like these way better than dumbbells or cables. And then tricep press downs. I did six sets of ten. I want to thank you for watching. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them below. Thank you.